And a growing number of U.S. veterans and people with training and experience in combat areas are looking to lend their skills to the Ukrainian resistance and humanitarian efforts. News 12's Brian Donahue chatted with a New Jersey native and Army vet who has made it his mission to help those who want to help Ukraine. Whether it's military service or otherwise, people who are able to thrive in chaotic, uncertain, and austere environments are the right fit for this. David Ribardo describes the few good people he's looking for to send to Ukraine to assist with the humanitarian efforts and in some cases perhaps even help the Ukrainian military in its fight against the Russian invasion. The Plainsboro native Rutgers grad and Afghan war vet founded the weeks old organization VolunteerForUkraine.org, which is sending U.S. veterans and other volunteers to the war zone and surrounding areas in Eastern Europe facing a refugee crisis. 3,000 have applied so far and dozens are leaving every day. Some people just needed a little bit of a nudge to be able to help out. Robardo and his team have had to weed out right-wing militia members trying to sign up and groups of friends with misguided video game inspired plans to hijack Russian tanks. To do that, 15 volunteers perform background checks and vet applicants to make sure they're getting people with the right experience and pair them with organizations on the ground in Europe who could use their help. We've had a lot of these quiet professionals, people with special operations backgrounds. I'm ready to go help. How can you best put me to use? And I'm like looking at this resume that's just a who's who of every major conflict in the past 15, 20 years. They've been there, done that. And so we've been able to get them uh, linked up with the right people. Robardo says he was inspired by his experience in the U.S. Army in Afghanistan, where he saw volunteers, including war veterans, who helped with extraction and other non-combat missions in the war zone. I watched that and I said, hey, those guys in Afghanistan made a big impact. What can we do? Volunteer for Ukraine also pairs donors willing to put up cash or even donate frequent flyer miles for a volunteer to travel to Poland or Ukraine. So even people who might not have that specific skill set can help put more boots on the ground. Brian Donahue, News 12, New Jersey. And as the humanitarian crisis grows, there is an urgent need not only for people with military experience, but even more so medical expertise.